everyone, I'm Sarah of Rich Textures Crochet and welcome. Today we are going to be learning how to crochet the delicate shell stitch, which you can see here in front of you. Now this stitch pattern is made up of these little tiny shell stitches, uh, which creates this very pretty fabric. It's the same on both sides. Uh, it doesn't work up too, too quickly because uh, the main stitches are single crochet stitches. But uh, but it doesn't use a whole, whole lot of yarn. It's going to create a nice, airy, light, weight fabric, as you can see. Today, for this tutorial, I'm going to be using a 5mm crochet hook, as well as a little bit of the paint box yarn. Today, I'm going to be using the color Slate Green. And you can find links to both of these items in the description of this video. Also, in the description of this video, you will find a link, direct link, to the free written and photo tutorial for this delicate shell stitch. Our pattern today is worked in rows, so you're going to start by making your slip knot, and then work a foundation chain. And your foundation chain needs to be a multiple of four plus two stitches. So today I'm going to chain a total of 26 uh, stitches. There's 10, 20, 25 and 26. Once you have your foundation chain, the desired length, you're going to start by working your first delicate shell. And your delicate shell is worked by working a single crochet into the second chain from your hook, so count in one, two. And into that second chain, you're going to work a single crochet, chain two and single crochet. That is your shell stitch. You're then going to skip the next chain and single crochet into the next stitch. Skip the next chain and work a shell stitch into the next chain. Single crochet, chain two, and single crochet. You're then going to repeat that all the way across. Skip the next chain, single crochet into the next stitch, skip the next chain, shell into the next. Repeat that all the way across where you will end with a delicate shell in your final stitch. I'm just working my final shell into my final stitch. At the end of row one, you can chain one and turn your work. For row two, you're going to begin by working a single crochet into that chain two space of the first shell. So into your chain two space, insert your hook and work one single crochet. Skip the next single crochet of that shell stitch and then into the next stitch work one shell. So single crochet, chain two, and single crochet. Single crochet into the next chain two of the shell. Skip the rest of your shell and then shell stitch into the next single crochet. So essentially you're working a single crochet stitch into the chain two space of each shell and then a, a shell stitch into each individual single crochet stitch. You're going to repeat that all the way across where you will end with a, sh a single crochet into the final chain two space of that final shell. I'm 
I'm here at the end of row two, working my final single crochet into the chain two space. At that time, at the end of row two, you can chain one and turn your work. For row three, you're now going to begin into that first single crochet stitch. You're going to work one shell stitch. Single crochet, chain two, and single crochet. Into the next chain two space, work one single crochet stitch. Skip the rest of your shell and then into that next single crochet, shell stitch, and single crochet into the next chain two space. Repeat that all the way across. I'm at the end of row three, working my final shell stitch. Chain one and turn your work. And that's it as far as the repeat is concerned. So for the rest of the pattern, you're going to simply repeat your rows two and your rows three. So your row two was where you started with a single crochet into that chain two space, followed by a shell. And your row three, where you started with a shell in that first space in that first single crochet and then a single crochet in the chain two space. So that's all there is to working this delicate shell stitch pattern. Thank you so much for joining me. While you're here I invite you to take a look around. This channel is updated weekly with uh, other stitch tutorials such as this one and uh, don't forget to subscribe. I look forward to seeing you next week. Until then happy crocheting. Bye!